guys so i want to show you how i record my podcast i have a super basic setup and this is an intention i said to myself that i wanted to make it the simplest as possible so i can keep recording on a weekly basis and i don't drop this project because for me if it gets more complicated then i just stop doing things and i postpone and i procrastinate so i want to share with you the apps that I use and then the gadgets that I have. So the first thing is the microphone. You will need a professional microphone. I got this one because most of my podcaster friends, they recommended it, but you can get a more affordable one. The most important thing here is that you can plug this one to your MacBook. So in this case, um, I have this one. So this is the one that I connect on my MacBook, right? So here. Once you plug it, then you can actually open a new file on GarageBand. So this is it. Once you connect the microphone to your GarageBand, it's gonna be, normally it is automatically detected. So if you can check the input, the microphone is there. And you can actually start recording right away. What I do is I remove this blue or this purple and then I set this one to time. Yeah. And I make sure that I'm close to the microphone. You can make a test too. So like you can press on record and then just check how it sounds. You can stop it and play it again. And then just listen to yourself how how it sounds if it has like proper quality and what i would do is like normally yeah i normally i personally do it in one go so i start recording i start speaking the best acoustic acoustic is in um like in your guard drop <laughs> if you can go to your guard drop but uh, in general i think this is a really good mic so i normally do it on my living room when i have guests or i do it on my um, bedroom and then that's how, how it looks you can right away on GarageBand crop the beginning and the end if you didn't start right away so you can just go to the beginning and just crop it with this um, it's like this uh, square bracket until the moment that you're speaking and then just move it to zero and then to the end and you can click on once once it's done you can click on share export song to disk and then you can just name it and export it on mp3 then to clean the audio means to remove the background noise or if there is any e echo then i normally drag and drop my file here on this podcast adobe to enhance voice and then I would just drag and drop here the, um, the file that I want to improve. And from there, for me, that's the final file. I don't do anything else. I know that some podcasters do use other programs. I personally don't. I keep it really, really simple. So then after that, I will just go to uh, Podcasters Spotify. And then I would upload it. And here I want to make uh, a little pause. And so basically, in, I use podcasters uh, and Spotify for uploading my podcast. And that, that will be published directly to Spotify and to uh, Apple Podcasts. So I just need to upload it once. Uh, you can create your account. It's free. It's podcasters.spotify.com. What you will need before launching your podcast is actually the name of your podcast. Now this is in Spanish, but I will translate the name of your podcast. In this case, uh, my podcast is called Entrepreneur Journey. I changed it with the time, so don't overthink it too much. You can just set a name from the beginning and then just um, you can change it after it. And then the description. On the description, if you are a service provider or a coach or Whatever you offer, it's a really good space to add the link of your work, like your portfolio or the way to work with you. So that's very important to have your offer here 
because this will drive you clients or collaborations or people who want to know more about you. And then you also would need the cover. For the cover of your podcast, I really recommend Canva and they already have some templates. So just, I really recommend you have a picture of yourself, the name of your podcast, and then your name too. So there are templates, you can just type in on podcast and there will be templates already. So you can just look for the one that looks the most um, authentic to you or align with your brand replace the picture, replace the name and export it. And then you can attach it to, um, to this, to the podcasters Spotify. And if you need help with your podcast, I'm happy to help you and to create a strategy around it. Maybe you want to brainstorm on which topics are coming, not only on the technical side, but what is more important is which topics do you want to talk about? So it will be a long lasting project. And it can be interviews, but it can also be self-reflections. And we can explore which are the topics that you will feel the most confident and competent on sharing and which are the keywords that your potential clients or your audience will be looking for. So you can book a call with me and then we can work on your podcast together to make it more strategic and to have a vision in the long term with your podcast. Thank you for watching and I hope that this was useful.